This is Gene Key, KDDD News. Two Dumas men have been accused of trying to use the U.S. mail to distribute drugs and threatening to kill a letter carrier. A federal grand jury in Amarillo on Tuesday indicted Tony Pamacana and Carlos Martin Gonzalez, both of Dumas. The Amarillo Globe News reported the men allegedly ran a marijuana distributing ring. Pamacana was charged with conspiracy and possession of marijuana with intent to distribute. He also was charged with threatening to kill a federal official and intimidate family members. Gonzalez faces two counts of threatening to kill a postal worker and family member, one count of conspiracy to possess and distribute marijuana, and another mail-related count. Kathy Colvin, a spokeswoman for the U.S. Attorney's Office in Dallas, says neither suspect is in custody. From NewsChannel10.com in Perryton, a traffic accident involving a school bus lands one man in a hospital. The Ockletree County Sheriff's Department says a pickup truck was traveling south in the northbound lanes heading into the Farnsworth area when it struck a Curry County Independent School District school bus. Fortunately, no students were aboard the bus and the bus driver was unharmed. The driver of the pickup truck was transported to Northwest Texas Hospital with several broken bones. A farmer about five miles west of Hereford found an explosive device Sunday around noon. The device was a commercial firework that had been modified by wrapping some birdshot around it. The device had a couple of balloons and a yellow light attached. The fuse appeared to have been lit but never went off. This is Gene Key, KDDD News.